So go ahead and describe these injuries, how you feel, how your arms work, and what your level of pain is right now. In my uh, neck, it's about a seven, and it's from a hotel bed, because I have uh, difficulty with that sometimes. And my arms, unless I'm trying to do something, and like I was just trying to get this one you know, to function in that, so it's about a six. Let's focus on just your left arm and okay. see if we can make progress on that one thing. So, left arm, six. Just show us how far you can move it when you have that range of limitation. Well, it depends on what direction, because I cannot get the elbow bent on either arm. Okay. Either way. And but, through elbows you broke, right? Right. Yes. And I can get it up to here. Right. I can't get it back any. Um, I can't get it in here at all. So if I do anything like I can do it to here, um, okay. if I try to go past that, then it's like a stabbing pain. Okay. Okay. That's telling you that thus far and no further. <laughs> right. right. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So just, just do that, like you're trying to get, say you're going to say, take off your glasses or brush your hair, just put your arm back like that as far as you can. That, that's as far as you can take it. Okay, good. Yeah, without right. really, really struggling. Right, okay. Okay, good. So there we have it. Sort of a starting point there. So tell us about the injury you had to your elbow while tapping? Um, this one, I was going into vote, early voting, and I didn't see the little step about that big and tripped on it and went down and went down on my left side because the year before I busted the right elbow in a fall and uh, was trying to protect it, and so um, went down, and it hurt pretty bad, and I knew it was not doing real good, so ended up having to have surgery and three screws. So when you were falling, you consciously protected your right elbow. I don't know if it was conscious or subconscious, mm -hmm. but I think it was probably a little bit of both. Right. And then you'd already had an injury to your other elbow. And uh, what happened to that? I'm curious. I didn't see the step down. Texas is famous for having step downs that, that little, and I didn't see it. And it went down and snapped the elbow or the bone right in front of the elbow and had a plate and six screws in that one. <laughs> this is like a kind of a construction in which Texas specializes. These, I think uh, so. Little, yeah, little, I think so. Little tiny I think, steps that take so. you out. <laughs> exactly. I really think so. They're the only place I've ever found them. <laughs> the Texan step. Yeah. yeah. The Texas two-step, because I did it twice. <laughs> Your least favorite dad. Right. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the Texas two-step. Yeah. <laughs> So, when you think about the phrase, I totally accept myself, even though I busted both elbows, how does that strike you? Do you accept yourself? I believe so. You do? Okay. Mm -hmm. So you feel okay about saying I accept myself? Mm -hmm. So even though I busted my elbow... Even though I busted my elbow. My other elbow. My other elbow. I totally and completely accept myself. I totally and completely accept myself. Even though... I busted my second elbow. Even though I busted my second elbow. <laughs> after I busted my first elbow. After I busted my first elbow. I fully and completely accept me. I fully and completely accept me. I fully and completely accept Jill.
I fully and completely accept Jill. Just as she is. Just as she is. With these elbows. With these elbows. Elbows and all. Elbows and all. I accept Jill. I accept Jill. Elbows and all. Elbows and all. Both elbows. Both elbows. <laughs> now, do you accept the pins and your elbows? I struggled with that because I didn't know that I could have gotten them out. Well, at least the plate and screws one that I could have gotten them out. And I, by the time I found out about it, I could have. It was too late. Yeah. You know. So explain that, because I didn't know anything about that kind of surgery. Well, they said they were going to put a small plate and a couple of screws, and they put a big plate and six screws, and then they didn't tell me that I could leave it in there for six months or so until it healed, and I found out about three years later, and they said that's probably not a good idea now because it's into the bone so much and that problem. So they could have taken it out. Possibly, yeah. And they didn't. Yeah. Yeah. How do you feel about that? I'm not really sure. I think I'm annoyed with them. Of course, I don't have a big opinion of Western medicine, although it's saved my life in numerous times. Right. But I still don't have a big opi opinion of it. So. Right. Even though I don't have a big opinion. Even though I don't have a big opinion of of Western medicine. Of Western medicine. And they could have taken it out. And they could have taken it out. The plate and the screws, are they? Yeah, screws. the plate and the screws. I still love and accept all of me. I still love and accept all of me. Even the plate and screws. Even the plate and screws. Even the parts that are screwed up. Even the parts that are screwed up. Or that are plated over. Oh, they're plated over. I accept all those parts of me. I accept all those parts of me. Because it's too late to get rid of them now. <laughs> too late to get rid of them now. They're in, there, they're, they're, they're in the bone. Yeah, they're in the bone. They're in the bone. Too late to get rid of them. Too late to get rid of them. They're part of me. I'm part of me. And I accept them. And I accept them. And it's hard to accept them. And it's hard to accept them. It yeah. is hard to accept them. Yeah. Things might have been different. Things might have been different. Things might have been different with my elbows. Things might have been different with my elbows. With that plate and those six screws. With that plate and six screws. And it's not different. It's not different. That's the way it is. That's the way it is. That's the way my body is. That's the way my body is. Forever and ever. Forever and ever. I'll have those screws. I'll have those screws. I'll have that plate. I'll have that plate. And I accept myself. And I accept myself. With that condition. With that condition. Okay, just take a breath. Let's check in with you right now and see how you're feeling. Nothing's hurting. Nothing's hurting. Wow. Is your neck feeling <laughs> better too? Oh, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, my neck, I can move it side to side. I couldn't a few minutes ago. Wow. I mean, nothing's... Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> I think you're saying that don't get better too quickly here. Yeah. It's a long demonstration. <laughs> okay, let's uh, do some more tapping. Yeah. Seconds. Okay, that's great. Okay. So, I accept all the parts of me. I accept all the parts of me. Fully and completely. Fully and completely. The parts that are easy to accept. Parts are easy to accept. And the parts that are hard to accept. And the parts that are hard to accept. Let's tap on the nine gamut over here. Close your eyes and open them. Keep your head steady. Eyes hard out to the left. Eyes hard out to the right. Eyes in a big, slow circle. Pins in my elbows. Pins in my elbows. Parts of myself I accept. Parts of myself I accept. Parts of myself I don't accept. Parts of myself I don't accept. Parts of my circumstances I don't accept. Parts of my circumstances I don't accept. Parts of my life I don't accept. Parts of my life I don't accept. Parts of my body I don't accept. Parts of my body I don't accept. I fully and completely. I fully and completely. Am me. Am me. The parts I accept. The parts I accept. And the parts I reject. And the parts I reject. It's all part of me. It's all part of me. It's all part of this wonderful person. It's all part of this wonderful person. Called Jill. Called Jill.
That people love and accept. That <laughs> people love and accept. That people love and respect. People love and respect. I am me. I am me. With these plates. With these plates. And pens. And pins. And screws. And screws. And all the other things. <laughs> and all the other missing parts. All the other missing parts. <laughs> I'm still me. Oh, I'm still me. I'm still lovable. I'm still lovable. I'm still totally acceptable. I'm still totally acceptable. People appreciate me. People appreciate me. People love me. People love me. Even without the missing parts. Even without the missing parts. <laughs> I accept me. I accept me. Without the missing parts. Without, without, without the, the missing, missing parts. parts. Everyone has missing parts. Everyone has <clears throat> missing parts. With missing parts. With missing parts. Without missing parts. Without missing parts. Accepting ourselves. Accepting ourselves. Not accepting ourselves. Not accepting ourselves. Accepting ourselves. Accepting ourselves. Just the way we are. Just the way we are. Just the way we are not. Just the way we are not. Okay, take a deep breath. Hmm. <sighs> Good. Feels even better. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you look happier now. Yeah. I, I felt yeah. some sadness coming up to you that seemed to be yeah. rising then. So. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I do. I feel a lot better. And besides the fact that nothing's hurting anymore. Right. Well, I'm, I'm even getting it closer. Wow, wow yeah. Wow, this is amazing. <laughs> Yeah, wow. That's beautiful. That's yeah. great. Thank you very oh. much. I appreciate Thank it. Thank you. I just love your energy. Thanks. I just, from the moment you walk in the door, just been Thank so you. touched by who you are and how you are. Thank so, you. That, yeah. I feel your energy the same way. Mm. I just, I'll, I'll tell you later. Uh, <laughs> yeah. But I really, I do. I, I just, I'm so happy that I'm here. Mm. And I'm glad that I'm getting to learn from you. Mm. And just getting to know you. Yes. Thanks. Thank you very mm. much. Appreciate mm. it. Thanks. I'm so happy here. Okay.